Today we are going to learn how to make a delicious vegan dessert from England. It's called Benefit Pie. We are going to start with creating the base. To create the base we are going to need the food processor and we will be uh, processing pecan nuts, cashew nuts and dates all together until we have a really nice and smooth paste. Now I'm uh, placing the dough into um, a pie mold. I'm gonna start with the sides and then continuing with the middle part. Just make sure that you have it really nicely filled up, leaving no space behind. Now that I have um, the sides, I'm going to continue with the middle part. Just push it gently down, making sure that it is evenly spread out. I'm using a um, tin cover to push it down. You can also use a glass or anything that helps you even it up. For the sides, I'm going to use a spoon, just pushing it inside. Our crust is perfect now, there is no air, it is even and flat and we are ready for step two. The next step is uh, putting it in the freezer for about uh, five minutes. So the second layer will be the chocolate sauce. We have a really nice um, ready-made chocolate sauce from Nature Charm and uh, it should be medium thick. So just try to add about 200 to 300 grams of chocolate which is about one cup. Evenly spread it out. So step one and two is done. We have our beautiful crust and chocolate sauce and now we're just gonna pop it in the freezer to set for about 30 minutes. The pie has been in the freezer for 30 minutes. Now we are going to continue with the third layer, which is the caramel sauce. I'm gonna add half a cup of caramel sauce. Spread it out nice and even. Use your spoon to help it get it into the edges. Just like step two with the chocolate sauce, we are going to put it back in the freezer for another 30 minutes to let it set and uh, firm up. I'm gonna chop the bananas and because they tend to brown up very quickly, I'm gonna add some lime juice and lime zest. Okay, now I'm gonna top it off with our beautiful bananas. Spread it out evenly. So you have bananas with every single bite. So now we are done with our fourth layer and uh, we can continue with the last layer, which is the whipped cream. While I'm doing the whipped cream, I'm gonna place this into the freezer. I'm going to use two cans of coconut whipped cream. I'm using the cold bowl to make sure that the whipped cream is nice and fluffy. And also because we're in Thailand, it's very hot here. <laughs> it helps us to keep the cream cool. We're not going to use the water left in a can. I'm just gonna whisk it together. To sweeten it up a little bit, I'm gonna add uh, some maple syrup and vanilla extract. Only add that after you have it really nice and thick. There you go. The last ingredient that I'm going to add is coffee syrup. This will just add uh, a little bit of this coffee and toffee flavor. The coffee syrup, I'm just gonna blend it together with the spoon. Now we're ready to put the cream on the pie. The whipped cream doesn't have to be overly sweet because we are going to have enough sweetness from the caramel and chocolate sauce. Just spread it out nicely so everything is well covered up. Just gonna create some texture to it. For decoration, I'm just gonna add a little bit of uh, cacao powder on top of the cream, which gives it a really, really nice look. There you go, you have a beautiful vegan benefit pie and you don't even need to bake it. We have five beautiful layers, starting with the crust, which is made with pecans, cashews and dates, then the chocolate sauce, caramel sauce, bananas, and the beautiful whipped cream on top of that. So once you put the cream on top, you can eat it right away, but I suggest to keep it in the fridge for a few hours or even overnight to have a firmer texture with each layer and also it will be much easier to slice through.